Man, for all you guys out there that thought, my old set looked like unbox therapy. I mean, we in it now. So welcome back to another episode of Rad Race Parts. Uh, this week, I got a super nice one for you guys. And uh, comes in this nice special package. So this week's race part comes from the guys over at Streetcar Fabrication. And uh, when he sent me this thing, I asked him, I got it in this box and I was like, man, that's pretty fancy. I wonder if he just did that for me or if that's something they do for all their customers. So I hit him up, I said, hey man, does your parts always come in a box like this? And he said, yep. He said, parts this nice, you don't want them to show up scratched or dented. I was like, yeah, makes sense. So Streetcar Fabrications makes all kinds of nice pieces. This is a transition piece made of aluminum. It's all CNC billet. They also make other parts too, kind of like this uh, T6 billet stainless turbo flange. I'll show you this one in another episode. This episode, we're gonna talk about this boy right here. So this is an all aluminum, all billet, CNC machine transition piece. So this one, this particular one is three inch, dual three inch in to one four inch out. Now they make all kinds of these things. Uh, I think they do like dual two inch in to a single two and a half out, dual two and a half in to three inch out, dual three in to three out, three and a half out, all the way up to dual three and a half to five, I believe, five inch. And they do them in aluminum and stainless, I believe, too. I believe they do all those sizes in both. Uh, super nice piece. The case is for sure justified because uh, you definitely don't want this thing showing up messed up. Just look at that transition in there. How red is that thing? Both sides. So whether you're doing, you know, an exhaust system, an induction system, uh, on, you know, on a really nice piece and you really want some really nice transitions, this is the way to go right here. What I've always found working on stuff is doing a transition from the same size tubing is, is not too difficult. So if you got dual threes to one three inch tubing, not terribly difficult. That's kind of the way the goose is. When you start mixing it up, you start going from, you know, dual three and a half to five inch or something, it gets a little tougher and a lot of times when you run that big tubing, it takes a ton of space. So this could also fix that problem as well. Transition with the best. They make all kinds of rad stuff, all made right here in the US of A. If you're doing a nice build and you want some quality parts, I mean, where I come from, we call this automotive jewelry. If you're working on a build or plan on working on a build in the near future, I suggest you go check out streetcarfabrication.com. Uh, you can also follow them on Facebook and Instagram, Streetcar Fabrication there as well. Uh, C-A-R-R, -R, car. Tell Donnie I sent you. Anyway, there you go, another episode of Rad Race Parts. I hope you bring you something rad every week. I've got some stuff lined up. And uh, yeah, that's the plan. If you wanna see Rad Race Parts, and you don't follow the channel already, hit the subscription. Every week, we're going to show you something red. As always, thank you for joining me. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I'll see you guys some more next week. Go do work, son. All right, little buddy, it's time for you to go home. Go night-night.